Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Pisces with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Pisces, we got the moon card and the knight of pentacles. It looks like somebody is questioning someone's loyalty, someone's devotion. Someone is also questioning um, someone's emotions. Are they, are they real? Are they true? It's almost as if somebody is in like some dualistic nature where they want to be in a committed relationship, but then they don't. They want to be in a committed relationship, but they also want to be single. So it's, it's like somebody's living, you know, two, two lives or they're of two minds about something, especially in terms of their emotions. And it could be you, Pisces, or it could be someone that you're dealing with. Um, let's see what's going on here. What's going on here for my Pisces? All right. Ace of Wands and the Four of Wands. Um, it's about being motivated to actually be rooted and grounded in a relationship. Actually taking the next step to be either married, living together in some type of commitment. This is what you either want or, or this is what someone around you wants. You will be more emotionally stable once someone makes some romantic proposal towards you. You feel as if this person isn't ready or they won't ever be ready or they just won't do it. There could be something else or someone else in the way. You're waiting for the perfect timing. Also, you may feel as if somebody is not over another person. They still fantasize about someone else. Or this is how you or this is how someone feels about you. There could be a wife and then there could be a mistress here. Somebody wants the relationship to be made real. Yeah, somebody goes in between two different people. There is a strong bond, a love between you and someone else. It looks as if you're frustrated, you're tired of waiting, but you know that you have a strong connection. The relationship is mutually beneficial for you some way. You're trying to reconcile with you, within yourself, you know, just to move on, you know, move on and know that um, this is as good as it gets for some of you. You feel like the relationship just isn't real or it hasn't been realized. You want some either public or just some type of proposal made to you or vice versa. This is what someone who you're dealing with wants. It seems as if you're not ready. Someone is not ready and they have a lot of options in love. Someone is going after a lot of different women also. Maybe even sleeping with a lot of different women. You're of two minds about commitment. And that's how the reading opened. That's pretty much how it will close here. Let's see what our Oracle deck has to say. Um, someone says, I can't, and I don't take you serious shrug. And someone is horrible with money. Okay. This could be you. It could be another person. Um, this is also why you, you don't take this person serious because they just are not good with money. Um, and you just aren't taking anyone serious because you're kind of in that dualistic nature in terms of, uh, wanting to be in a commitment and then wanting to be single. Some relationship could be making you a bit miserable, right? So this is what I have for you, Pisces. If it resonates, go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. All questions are, all links are below if you need to get in contact with me. 
I am live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Happy holidays. Happy New Year. Thank you. Take care.